What's up, everybody? It's J Mac, and welcome back to Bigfoot Input. I got an interesting video today. It's been around on the internet for a while. Um, I've been asked to do it a couple times, and today I have an eight second clip of it saved in my archive, but I felt like you guys deserved more than that, so I went and actually found the real video that it comes from. So I want to remind you guys that before you watch the video, uh, it's about nine minutes long. So I've really, you can edit it down to literally eight seconds to see the creature, but I've edited it down to about a minute just so you can kind of see the surroundings and get the tempo of the video. Understand that this is Facebook live. This is no type of recording or, a you know, video trick or anything like that. It's really kind of impossible. Uh, the guy is literally just, I guess what you would call vlogging. He's just sort of video talking to his friends and he's freaked out about something that he's seen in his backyard and he goes to film it or he goes to film his backyard again, you know, uh, to show everybody where this picture came from that he has. And then we actually see uh, a video of the said creature. Yeah, this is kind of in a, not really, I wouldn't call it suburban area, but it's not really rural either. Um, it's somewhere in between. I believe the guy is from like St. Petersburg, Florida in that area. So, you know, you can get in various areas where you're in the city and then you're like you know, on a country road. So I, I believe I can see some lights in the woods that are probably like a neighbor's house. So, you know, he has a big backyard. Let's just put it to you that way. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just play the little snippet of the video for you. I am going to warn you ahead of time. I considered muting it, but I don't really think it gives you the, the good idea of what's going on here. So I want to play it with audio. Um, I'm going to warn you that you're going to hear the F-bomb, you know, probably four or five times. It's kind of just the way the guy talks. Um, so, you know, viewer discretion is advised. Uh, I, I do think that you'll find it worth it, though. So uh, here we go. Why is it blue? That's the exact motherfucker I'm on site now. That's my backyard. So we didn't a little piece. This is the this is the exact spot that I just saw. <laughs> All right, so he's obviously pretty freaked out. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on here, though. So he opens the door and he flips the camera from front facing to rear facing, and we're getting a look at a light pole under some power lines. Now, I've heard various theories here. I've heard that uh, it's cigarette smoke, which is absolutely ludicrous. All right. We're going we're gonna to zoom in, and we're going to go frame by frame. I'm all the way to the left of the screen right now. Here comes the creature. We only get, it looks like we're only gonna get about one good shot of this thing.
I mean, I don't know where this creature would be going or why it's showing itself at all, frankly. But you can see, like, when it first enters the screen on the left right there, it's not on the ground. It's like its leg hits the ground. See it coming down? Right there. It's about to touch the ground. Boom. And so it touches. And that's the only time it touches. And then it looks like it jumps back up. And then it goes. And he freaks out and shuts the door. I mean, I can't blame him. Weird. Look at that. I'd like to zoom in a little bit if I can. If I can ask for your patience here. I want to get... Just the right shot. To zoom in on. Unfortunately, there's just not a lot to make out. It, the creature is so fast that his camera just can't keep up with it. It just catches like a flash. And then the lighting above is not necessarily helping the situation. It is illuminating it, but I think it's also distorting it. I think as you guys have probably already figured we're going to walk away from this with an inconclusive but i think what you're going to hear a lot of in the comments is you know it's a wendigo it's a skinwalker it's a dog man and I've even heard someone say one time that they thought it was just a, like a bird, but it's too big to be a bird. I mean, if you know, it's a bird like, yeah, kind of swooping in and reaching down to the ground. I kind of get that perspective, but it's huge. I mean, unless it's a pterodactyl, I just, I don't think it's a bird. Um, and it wouldn't be, you know, a bird wouldn't be translucent like this. I know it's, again, the camera and the, the creature in motion. It's really causing some nasty distortion. Uh, but uh, I just don't buy, I'm not buying the bird theory. If it was a bird, it'd have to be like a, like an emu, you know. And I mean, it looks like, I don't know if it can fly, but it can definitely jump. What it's not is cigarette smoke, and that's a ridiculous theory. It obviously has determined motion, and it just jumps right there beside that pole. Boom. Jump. Jump. And uh, I wish I could give you guys a little bit more of a... more of a... Uh, explanation really or at least an educated guess of what i think it is but uh i'm at a loss so i'm gonna leave it to the guys in the comments to uh to chop this up and and tell us what you think about it okay guys anyway either way i hope you enjoyed it all right and this is j mac and i'm out